All right, guys, a quick one. Here, I'll detail how to log Samsung Galaxy phone remotely. So if you misplace your Samsung Galaxy phone or someone took your Samsung phone at God point, or you don't know where you actually placed your Samsung Galaxy device, but you need to log the phone remotely, then here's the video for you. So if I don't know this, you found this often informative, please don't forget to like and then subscribe. First, you need to make sure you turn on these settings for your Samsung phone to lock it remotely. So go to your Samsung phone settings, scroll down, click on security and privacy or biometrics and privacy. Then scroll down, locate and click on more security settings. Scroll down and click on theft protection. Under theft protection, scroll down, locate and click on remote lock. Now, if remote lock or theft protection is missing under more security and under your biometrics and privacy or security and privacy, just go ahead, click on the magnify search on the main page and search for theft protection. Then once you see theft protection from the result, go ahead and click on theft protection. Then locate and click on it from the settings page. Scroll down, locate and click on remote lock. Then turn on remote lock if it is disabled. Now once you turn on remote lock, you discover that your Samsung phone will automatically pop your phone number here. Now when next your Samsung phone is stolen or you couldn't find your Samsung phone and you want to lock your Samsung phone, all you just need to do is make sure you grab any of this phone number and go to android.com forward slash lock on any device. This could be your PC and it could be a third party phone. So just go to the website and then type in your phone number like this. So it's just go to android.com forward slash lock. Then you may be prompted to sign into your Google account. There's no reason to scare. Just go ahead and type that. Just go ahead and sign into your Google account and then type in your phone number. Once you type in your phone number, click on lock device. Then hang on. Then you see the device locked. So this policy will need to type in your passcode to unlock the device. Accept the deposit node, the passcode, or can unlock your iPhone without your permission. So that's exactly how to lock Samsung phone remotely. Then you see, lock request is sent. So this is going to lock your device remotely, whether you have access to it or not. And then you see from the pop, it says, check the remote lock settings to make changes if you want to ever make changes to it. So that is basically how to lock Samsung Galaxy phone remotely. So if you found this often informative, Please don't forget to like and then subscribe.